Well, hello everyone, this is Stevio, and we are back in Flint Hills, Iowa. And we are back on the farm. Today, we're pulling a fertilizer tank. Because, yeah, we got a... Uh-oh. Uh-oh. What's going on here? Oh, goodness. Oh, man. Almost run me off the road. What is going on over there? Uh, it doesn't appear like it came from clutches... Maybe? Uh-oh. We got something going on on the side of the road here. Oh, no. Uh-oh. Them tanks looks like what Farm Boy was pulling. Oh, man. I see a lot of lights. This isn't good. This is not good. Oh, yeah. I'm pretty sure that's Farm Boy. Oh man, lights all over the place. Let's see what's going on here. Whew! Good news is everyone's okay. Just that these were probably a little bit too full for Farm Boy to be pulling down a country road at high speeds. They called 911 just as a precaution because he did end up with getting a nick on top of his head. Thank you for uh, Grant. He came over here when he heard the accident. Helped out farm boy, called 911. Yeah, let's get back. I think we're gonna have to end up pulling that out of the road so it doesn't block traffic anymore. Let's go around this. Oh, 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 I'm about ready to get myself into the ditch here. Here we go. Grant says he'll stay until I can get back here with a tractor. Man, look at that mess back there. I'm just glad farm boy's okay. We have an extremely busy day, so I am going to probably be without Farm Boy all day. I'm at least going to give him the day off after something like that. Yeah, it's not something you want to uh, look forward to, so I need to get soybeans planted. It is way late. It's July. I, we usually don't plant this late, but there is going to be a huge rainstorm coming up. So, I think, I wonder if this old Chevy will pull it up this hill. Need to get uh, 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 Is it coming? Oh, 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 there we go. Man, I like my new Chevy. Alright, pull that. Alright, this is going to be a little applicator tank. We're going to pull behind the planter here. Yeah, yeah. That's another project for today. We need to unload all of our grain we got in all of our trucks and grain carts. Man, work on the farm just never seems like it ever stops. Let's get over here, pull out Farm Boy's truck here. I wonder if Farm Boy was getting ready to honk at Grant and got out of control. Maybe. Maybe. Okay. Let's see. Probably gonna go around on the ditch here. Alright, Grant, you're gonna have to move the old Ford unless you want to use it to pull out the Chevy. Ah, uh, that would just be embarrassing. Definitely love the suspension on this truck. Definitely worth the extra sticker price. Alright. I think that's close enough to hook up a chain. Man, I do love the AT4's hooks they have on front here. They come in convenient. Alright. Let's see, I don't know if we're going to get up, end up getting a ticket, Farm Boy's going to get a ticket or something. Oh shoot, now the cop got into these ditches are unforgiving. Oh man, going to have to use the old Chevy once more. Alright, undid the chain, oh wow, not going to wait, not going to thank me. Alright, you can't turn off your lights. Um, maybe they had to respond to another incident? I have no idea. There goes Grant. Oh, oops. I probably should have left the blinkers on. Gonna have to run back there and go get Farm Boy's truck. See you later, Grant. Yeah, yeah. Give him a little honky honk. Now we gotta unload uh, Farm Boy's 8410 here. Yeah, yeah. It's still at the shop. What? The, the front looks a little high to me. That thing's squatting in the back. Or is it just where it's sitting? 
Maybe it's just where it's sitting. Now that it's not overflown. Oh. Yeah, I can barely turn this thing. Yeah, I think we're gonna have to put some more weight on the front of this old girl. It's a little odd. Definitely be doing the power hops right now. Get over here. Alright, start unloading the Kinsey. After this, we gotta unload the cab over. Alright, I guess we go park this over to the side. Yeah, I couldn't hardly turn this thing when I had that Kinsey loaded down. Something's got to be a little, uh, got to put some more heavier weight. Watch out. Don't hit that auger there. Yeah, I had to use the brakes to turn this thing. I don't know what exactly is going on with that thing. Uh, doesn't... Yeah, the front isn't high now. Definitely must have been the weight on the tongue. Alright, just heading back from the co-op, Jake hooked us up with one heck of a bill. You're probably asking yourself, why the heck do you need that much seed? Let's just say we got a huge demo coming to the yard. It's actually over there at Grant's right now. We are demoing it right after him. And, uh, yeah... Using this demo on the field that we're going to use it on is, I guess, a little bit embarrassing because it's not big, but we do have a pretty good sized field that we're going to be uh, pulling this thing to. Where do I need this seed? But before we get to that, we actually have to do uh, one something a little strange, like uh, actually harvest around some bales. I need to pick them up before I plant. Not like last time. I need to do the right thing this time, I guess. Alright, so I actually need the 4020 back here. I'm gonna put that on the loader. I need to put the loader on that so I can lift these bales. And of course, I have a whole bunch of stuff in my way. Gotta get that out of the way. Yeah, I could have used the 6000, but it's on the auger, so I'm just gonna keep it on that. All right, got the old pride and joy running here. Gonna do a little bale spear in here. Yep, yep. Love Grandpa's old tractor here. Right, got the bale trailer hooked up. Now we gotta go to the field. This might be a little embarrassing. Man, do I love how this, uh, this how this straight piped 4020 sounds. Listen to that diesel purr. She's definitely not going to break any speed records going down the road, but, uh, I'm not going to get rid of her. So, this is our field. We already harvested it, and, uh, yeah, we had to harvest around these bales. I know, this is a little bit embarrassing. So, we got these bales sitting here in random spots in the field. Alright, unhook this gooseneck here. Now, we got to do a little bale sparing, yeah. Look at that. Yeah, it's a little bit embarrassing. Yeah, we didn't really lose that much crop, though. Here, oh yeah. Yeah, there we go. A little bit heavy on the old girl here. Put this girl right over there. Try to... There we go. There's one down. My... 20 to go. Yep. And there's some more over here. Oh man. I, I wasn't expecting this many bales or I wasn't. There's some more over there on that corner. Uh, we're going to have a hard time fitting all these on this trailer. Oh, uh, I have no idea. Will they all fit? Uh... What do we have? Four more? Oh, yeah. I guess we're going to have to spear one, and they're just barely going to fit. This old 4020 is getting way down. Might... Oh, yeah. We're going to have to remember. 
definitely need some weight up in front of it. That old girl, that's a lot of weight back there. Like goose neck. Well, line up just perfect to be able to put this last one on here. Uh, still didn't get it perfect, oh well. Oh, 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 there we go. Well, yeah, look at that trailer. Load it down. Uh, easy does it. This thing is a little tipsy when you get these. Oh, yeah, definitely don't like that heavy bale that far up. They're a little bit waterlogged, if you could say. Last bales on the tra trailer. Just need a spear one more here. We have all the bales finally picked up. It just took us two months, and now they're all waterlogged, and they're probably useless as straw bales, that's for sure. Okay, yep, 4020. Definitely getting a workout today. Full steam ahead at like 12 mile an hour. All right, now that that's done, we need to get over to Grant's finally pick up this giant demo. Hopefully the Steiger has it in it. We'll see. Ooh, Grant has it on his uh, 9400 here. Man, I'm surprised that 9400 has it in it. Look how big that thing is. She's giant. John Deere with the C850 air cart. This air cart alone is bigger than both the John Deere and the uh, Steiger together. This Cedar is giant. Size does matter. Oh yeah, you definitely feel her on there. Wow. Yep major piece of equipment. Never thought I'd be planting with this big of a planter. Alright, I had to park this uh, gator right beside it just to see the magnitude of this cedar. And boy, oh boy, I mean look at these tires. They go up way above this gator. Gator has nothing on this. I don't even think this gator can actually pull this drawbar here. That's how uh, heavy this thing's got to be. I, I know I hooked up the gator. It's just because the old Steiger blew a hydraulic hose. I had to go get that fixed right away before we pull this. Will this thing pull this giant cedar? I mean, it doesn't even come close to having the enough hydraulics. You guys also have to think, look how rinky dink this little uh, trailer is. Now this is a 1500 gallon little fertilizer trailer that would look large behind any planter. Yeah, look how tiny it looks. You can't even see that thing. That thing's completely out of eyesight when it's behind this air seater and the cab. Doesn't matter if you're in the Gator or the Steiger. All right, now let's see if this thing will pull it. Uh, it's going. Uh, it's going. I got forward momentum, so I'm gonna keep, it must be because I'm going downhill. Keep it up, keep it up. Oh, my tire's gonna hit, I can't stop. Oh, oh, it's gonna run over the curb. Little gator that could. I would have never imagined. Don't worry, y'all. That's just in game physics there. That is not the gator. That's not realistic physics right there. Will it pull the fertilizer cart? Yep, it does pull that at least. Alright, yep. I guess we could use it for, uh,. Moving this thing around at least. Alright, enough messing around. We got that filled up. Now it's time to put the stagger to work. 
now's the question will this Steiger end up uh, pulling this giant drill into our tiny little field over here been timing it we are only at seven minutes but we are just about done a few more rounds gotta clean up a few uh, spots we miss thank you all for watching and i will see you next time over here in iowa Field's done. Let's see how much seed we actually used here. Uh, I don't see any seed missing. Hopefully we put some down in the field. Whoa. Uh -oh. You want to play with all these mods and more? Check out Apex Game PC. They make a PC for anybody's needs. Check them out. Use Code Squad. Save 10%. Later, y'all.